welcome back to my channel my name's amber this is fabricating fringe today i'm sharing with you this beautiful short curly wig by tressler wigs this here new style is called cheers i love this blonde color the blonde color is 24 102 r12 now when i first tried on this here style the vibe that i received once i started smoothing out some of the curls is I felt like, you know, Marilyn Monroe vibes. When you get this wig out of the box, the ringlets are very formed and individual. What I did is I used my wide tooth comb and I smoothed out those curls. Now, what I love about this style is once you smooth out those ringlets, it doesn't frizz up. Um, it just has more of a soft texture, a soft blended texture. So you can have kind of a full soft blended texture or you can take your brush very carefully, very gently and try to form and mold those curls into more of a like a 40s, 50s, um, kind of like a retro look. Back in the day, they did roller sets, they did finger waves, and once they combed that out, they would then take their brush and they would mold the style into their desired look. With these here curls, I feel like that is very, very doable. You don't have the frizz, but you do have the curls and the shape. So with your synthetic fibers, a wide tooth comb is more gentle, um, but with these beautiful fibers, you can use heat tools at a low setting to change the fibers up. I love that about some of these Tressler wigs is you can you know, really switch it up because of those fibers. I did gently use a brush, being mindful of those fibers, making sure I wasn't stretching and pulling and causing any damage on the fibers. That helped me form that luxurious old Hollywood um, Marilyn Monroe retro look. And then of course I pulled it up because this here Cheers wig has the most beautiful lace front. I have discovered that with my Tressler wigs is their lace fronts are fantastic. Here is the lace front if you want a closer look. You do have a dark root on this here style, but the way they knot and you know intermix some of those lighter colors with that dark root right up front, you don't have like a bar of color of blonde, but they just mix it so well and it makes that lace front look fantastic as you can see. Now I just took out the pin that I had in my hair so you guys can see the bang and the length and the layers of this here cheers wig. But before we talk about all those details, let's talk about this color. So this blonde 24102 R12 is a gold blonde with platinum highlights and gold brown roots. Now this definitely does have, you know, a golden brown root. I think it looks really pretty. Um, it's a great contrast to the warm blonde and also that blend with your platinum. So if you like that platinum blonde, that light blonde, but you still like a little bit of warmth, this is a beautiful shade. Now this is from the Tressler Look Fabulous collection. And this is just your stunning mid-length bob. This bob features a nice wave to the front and those soft S curls that are bouncy and beautiful. You have a lot of texture and volume in this style. If you wanted to smooth it down, you could. You could smooth those waves and have it be less voluminous. Um, you really do have a lot of options. Um, just play with it, have fun. Now the fibers look wonderful straight out of the box. These are the Tressler Style Able Effortless Synthetic Fiber. When you use your heat tools, you want to stay between 275 to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Now let's do a full turnaround and show you guys this beautiful Cheers wig from all angles. Okay, let's take Cheers off and show you guys the underside. What you have is their one and one fourth inch lace front. This is a wonderful, undetectable hairline. It's individually hand tied. You can wear it off the face or front facing, side swept across the forehead if you wish. Um, I love this beautiful lace front. And then what you have is their monofilament top. This is sheer and soft. You have your hand knotted mesh top for the ultimate comfort 
And of course, you can have that room for multi-directional parting. Um, along with that lace front, it just looks like the hair is growing out of your scalp. And then what you have with the remaining area of this cap is open west. This keeps the price point down and also it's great ventilation. You have a lot of airflow with this wefted wig. The stretch wefting provides secure comfort, fit, and molds itself to the contours of the wearer's head for a more customized fit. And then of course you have your velvet ear tabs with that bendable wire and your velvet nape with the adjusters at the nape. Here's a closer look of that gorgeous color. You can see the warmth, but you can also see the platinum in there and then that warm root. Okay, let's put her back on. This Cheers wig is average. It feels wonderful. I wear average in the majority of wigs, especially Tress Allure. This is comfortable, it's secure, and it fits me from front to nape and ear to ear. My head circumference is 21 and a half inches, and this feels fantastic. The front of Cheers is 3.5 inches. Your crown is 10 inches. Your sides are also 10 inches. Your back is eight inches. The nape is also eight inches. And the product weight for Cheers is 4.12 ounces. It feels nice and light and bouncy. If you want a wig that's off the shoulders, of course, you do have those springy curls, so if you were to straighten it, it would hit you know, below the collarbone, it seems like. But with those springy curls, it kind of sits on the shoulders. It's very fun. Um, it's just a beautiful, just glam looking wig. Now, if I use my comb, I brush through some of these curls and really form them into a soft, molded look. I feel like it just creates the most old Hollywood glam appearance. And these curls are so soft, they just easily mold and shape. The fibers feel awesome. Just really great fibers to style, which is fantastic since with this style, you have the ability to use your heat tools. Now I didn't really do the back since I can't see it. It would probably be best to work on this here style, maybe put the wig on a block head so I can see what I'm doing in the back. But look, I just used a brush. I added smoothness to the curls rather than having them more fluffy. Now I've often talked about the products from Tressler. Their Tress Tech products are absolutely wonderful. I love the wig wax. So if you want to add that volume, um, you know, really keep your style in place, this wig wax is fantastic. Um, I've talked about it before. It's specially formulated for all types of synthetic and human hair. Um, it's for extensions, additions, and wigs. You want to shake the wig wax well and spray on dry hair from 12 inches away. It holds and retains the finished hairstyle for a period of time. Tossle liberally with your fingers to create body and texture. You want to allow to dry naturally or blow dry on a cool temperature setting. So if you spray and then use some cool air to dry, you can have some maximum volume and styling ability using this wig wax. Now I love this little wig wax bottle. They have a, a taller bottle and this is more of a travel sized option. I really, really like it. If you're traveling, if you're wanting to go on a trip, you need to pop it in your purse. Um, this is a fantastic smaller option to this wonderful product.
I just love this product. So speaking of new products, I want to talk about a few more things that are now available from Trust Tech by Tressler. This is really exciting. I've been meaning to talk about it for a little bit, but this is their dry spray shampoo and their dual leave-in conditioner. This dry shampoo volumizes and cleanses hair by absorbing dirt, oil, sweat, and odor. Love this dry shampoo. This has no talc, uh, by the way. You shake, you clean, you style. This is specially formulated for all types of synthetic and human hair, extensions, additions, and wigs. You wanna shake the can well. Uh, also, you want to give your wig a good shake. Hold the can 10 to 12 inches away from your wig, and then you can apply to the wig roots one inch at a time. Then you work the product through the wig with your fingers. You can lightly spray the hair of your wig with this hair product to add texture and volume. I am so thrilled about this because heaven knows sometimes I put off cleaning my wigs. Life is crazy. So this will allow you to get by um, until you're able to wash your wig. And also another thing is this is going to add some great texture to your styles. Now let's talk about the dual leave-in conditioner. I love this. This instantly tames frizz by adding softness, smoothness, and shine. So um, you guys, you know that with your wigs, if you're wearing them for a prolonged period of time, you have product, um, just the environment, build up, that kind of thing, they can start looking kind of dingy and dull. So this dual leave-in conditioner, it gives you that nice smoothness and shine, the way that it looks and feels when you have a fresh wash. Sometimes when you've worn a wig for a little bit longer than you probably should, you can have some frizz and this will help tame that. This is formulated for synthetic wigs and extensions. You'll want to hold this product eight to 10 inches away from your wig, and then you'll spray the roots and all over the wig or your extensions. Then you'll allow it to dry before you add any additional Trust Tech styling products. Check out these products. Um, I have really loved, like I mentioned, this wig wax. So I know that this wonderful new duo, this uh, leave-in conditioner, and your dry shampoo spray, um, really thrilled with these products. Can't wait to use them. I will have a store locator down below so you can check out this new Cheers wig and their products. There are many brick and mortar and online locations who can get you these products or wigs. I want to thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think about this short, fun style, this ringlety fun style, and how do you like the way I styled this here wig in a more retro, vintage, old Hollywood look. Give me a like and subscribe for more content. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.